Wants to watch Weekly Objective, Diego Jota has been released today in Weekly Objectives and he does look like an incredible card right at the start of FIFA 21 Ultimate Team for EA Sports giving this out for free and of course he does have that possibility of getting a future upgrade, has been performing pretty well for Liverpool already getting himself a debut goal so he does definitely have some potential and already with a very good foundation, 5 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves he definitely has amazing potential with a few upgrades to either be an absolutely incredible great super sub or at least he can even be a starter team if you do have a Premier League starter team don't want to be spending too many coins maybe you are trading he can definitely fit in there so make sure you guys do watch the full video we're going to be going over how to get him as quickly as possible and also talking about a little change EA have done in objectives that is a little bit sus so getting straight into it now the suspect thing that EA have done is now you are forced to play squad battles and division rivals before you could just play division rivals and you could also do the squad battle part in that so it would say squad battles or division rivals and then you are forced to play some division rivals but now you are actually on its own forced to play squad battles and I believe we didn't have that in any objectives last year in of course these card objectives that we did get on Fridays with these sort of promotions as we can see here Portuguese pro we do have squad battles we need to play on professional different difficulty and for two of these objectives both of them we do need to be using anyone who is a Liga Nos player and four star skill moves with them we are going to be scoring in four matches that is going to be Portuguese pro and then we do need to also assist in five matches that is going to be skilled in battle so if we can do both of these together we're still forced to play five matches of squad battles which is quite a lot and on top of that you are going to be having five of the division rival games at least so that is a little bit annoying and you can understand how I think EA added in here a little bit cheeky from them. It is going to take us now a little bit longer on these objectives. Whereas it might have only took us maximum 5-6 games in the past years like FIFA 20. We are going to have to move though from that. We still have to carry on of course if we want this card. So we are going to be playing those squad battles. Professional difficulty, anyone who is from Liga Nos and also 4 star skill moves. You need to just score in 4 matches and assist in five matches you can use Everton that is the card I did use you can just sub him on I tested it out as we can see here I do have one of each so you can be using any of these cards if one of them becomes expensive go for the other one you only need one of these since it is squad battles it is going to be very easy very straightforward so you do have Portuguese pro and also skilled in battle completed and that is actually going to be helping you in these division rivals ones you do need to use a Premier League Portuguese player to try and do all of the rivals ones at once there are a few cards for example Spurs Fernandez, also Ivan Cavalero. there are also Daniel Podence but he's a little bit more expensive and then of course you do have Diego Jota and you do actually get from this first objective Portuguese Pro Squad Battles make sure you do them first because you are going to be getting a Diego Jota loan card for 5 matches and that should be enough for when you use him in Div Rivals so you can complete all of them, what you're going to be doing with this lone shot a card score two goals in five matches that is going to be quite tricky especially if you are in the higher divisions very difficult for sure especially div one that is going to be absolutely brutal then as you go down div two div three it is going to become more and more possible but let me know down in the comments below if you guys are in div one maybe this is not a card that interests you or maybe if you want to get him just in case he does get those upgrades great super sub in my opinion how are you going to be trying to get him just sub him on maybe and just try your best play him at striker but scoring those two goals in five matches that's going to be the hardest part then also you do need to be scoring 10 finesse shot goals that is pretty much going to be coming as you do all of these other rivals objectives you don't need to give it too much focus just remember if you do get a blatant opportunity just go ahead and finesse it to get this done and then you are going to be doing assist with a through ball four matches that is going to complete the second objective on here so like I mentioned squad battles first Portuguese pro and skilled in battle I would recommend just subbing on Everton play squad battles professional difficulty and then you are going to be using that Diego Jota loan card for five matches that should hopefully be enough but if it isn't then like I mentioned Spurs Fernandez maybe one of those cards Podence you might have to spend 7,000 coins but then you can sell him on after you're going to be scoring two goals in five matches then 10 finesse shots and make sure you do also assist with a through ball in four matches let me know down 
down comments below are you going to be going for this card definitely in my opinion i will give it a go you do also have 12 days remaining thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you next time